Okay, good week of practice. Uh, we need uh, U.S. Bank State and Rucking this week, and uh, go out and play good and try and get a victory. With the Bears' defense and how they've been, do you put more emphasis on ball security this week during practice? Yeah, definitely. I mean, they're, they're number one in the league in turn, turnovers, interceptions. They've been great. Um, they're very good in the back end at uh, having eyes on the ball. Uh, you know, and obviously they're good in, in the rush. How much of an guys, emphasis? Guys out for this week: um, Cam, Cheryl's, Kendricks, Levy, questionable Rhodes. Anything else you want to talk about? <laughs> 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 yeah, I'll, do, I'll do your job. You do mine. <laughs> How much of an emphasis do you put on a fast start on offense, given the, the way the offense started the last few weeks? Yeah, uh, we talked we talked about it. Um, you know, last week we didn't start fast. The week before we did. So, uh, you know, they're they're extremely good on defense. They're very very good. Um, and uh, and quite honestly, we need to start fast on defense as well. Uh, you know, teams have moved the ball. On us a little bit defensively, um, and so we need to do a better job coming out of the gates as well. With Cheryl's out, what what does this team need to do on special teams to remain as explosive as when he's in there? Yeah, well, you know the biggest thing is um, we've got to take care of the football number one, and then we got to get on our block. So we'll have uh, you know some guys in there to try and help with that, and um, you know the, the better opportunities we have to flip the field position, the better opportunities is for us to win the game. With Kendrick's out, how much added confidence do you have in seeing Wilson play? Such a solid and a high snap game last week. Yeah, and he played a lot against Chicago when Bart didn't play the first time. So um, Eric's a good football player. We expect him to do a great job. Like when the offense has gotten off to a slow start in some games, can you put your finger on anything of why that's happening in those games while other games you get off to a quick start? You know, sometimes it's just the defense that you're playing. Um, it's, you know, last week was, you know, we started on a half yard line, so that makes it. You know, difficult. We're just trying to get out, get out of dodge a little bit, but uh, so that limits your your playbook, you know, quite a bit. Um, so it's just a lot of times it's just defense situation that you're that you're in. How's how's having Anthony Barr and David David Morgan on the offensive side really help as you build the game plans this week? I know you're missing a couple guys, but getting those guys back. And yeah, well, Bar Barr's done an outstanding job this year. Uh, you know, he's played very, very well. He's a, he's a really a, a extremely bright kid. And uh, and Morgan, you know, Morgan adds a little bit of toughness to the uh, to the offensive unit. And so, you know, that's always a good thing. Because of the situation with this game with the Bears, do you spend more time on Chase Daniel as a backup just in case he ends up playing later in the game? Or? Well, we spend time on everybody. But, you know, there was, I think, uh, three games on Daniels that we, we watched. We got a chance to talk to Mike Hughes earlier about his rehab. What are you excited about with him uh, going into next year? Um, it's a little early to talk about next year. Yeah. So, but I like Mike Hughes. He didn't really have much as far as a timeline, but can you take any sort of solace in the way that, you know, similarities and injuries with Dalvin's and kind of when that happened and then maybe he could be back potentially around the same time Dalvin was? Yeah, each injury is different. You know, his injury was different than Dalvin's, so, um, you know, it's hard, hard, to, hard to say. Mike, obviously they have all sorts of talent on defense, but is, is there one thing that they do schematically that impresses you? Uh, yeah. I think they do a really, really good job in the back end of playing uh, complementary coverages where um, it's hard to recognize exactly what you're getting all the time. Um, you know, sometimes it's it's too strong and quarter's weak. Sometimes it's quarter. Sometimes it's three weak. Sometimes it's two man. Sometimes it's eleven or one robber. So, uh, but they do. I, I think they do a really nice job. Uh, it's hard to tell pre-snap. Uh, on what they're doing, and um, so that part, um, and they got good cover guys. You know, the two corners are good corners. Um, you know, the two safeties are good safeties. So um, uh, I think that part is really good schematically. You know, the the front guys, they just kind of you know, maul you. When they're able to disguise things that well, what does it require of the quarterback to be able to, to get through that and make his reads effective? Yeah, a lot of times it's post snap, but you know it's always continually looking for tips. You know where you can see things pre snap. 
but um, but they do a really good job with that. The corners are, you know, sometimes they're off and pressed and playing man. Sometimes they're, um, you know, squatting. Uh, you know, so there's a lot of different things that they do. But a lot of times it has to have a post snap. You've talked about uh, the Chicago game a couple times. You guys didn't run enough in that game. Do you? I know it's a different foe, but do you need to kind of have the attitude you had against Detroit? I mean. Maybe it didn't start out that well, but you guys stuck to it and ended up having a solid running out against. Well, um, we're going to do whatever we need to do to win. If that's throwing it uh, a lot of times, hopefully not four to six, and running it 14, but uh, we're going to do what we need to do uh, to try to win the football game. You know, turnovers. Um, obviously, you know, we had three turnovers. They had three turnovers in the first game, so you know that will probably play a big factor in this ball game as well. Good. Thank you.